Oyagala omukuru ku gwenja olugo berene bijukize mu nyumba yo kan kwanjulire backing montage photo studio fiba kafuru mu kuba bifananyi no kola video oli na wedding birthday party kuchala nika baby shower photo shoot or music shoot na buli kimu kyo nacho oyagala fetu subulu kuwe bijukize birungi eri biroto byo ate no mwana watu kusinte zo mtu wa buli jo tusange bana nkula bikubitala ku prime tower level 3 room d04 okumanya bisingawo tukubira ku namba zino note musavu note biri emu note nya emu biri tano Oba, noti musavu tanu tanu, satu emu emu, musavu satu emu, oba, noti musavu musavu musavu, noti bili satu, nya noti tanu. King Montage Photo Studio, fitu sobolo kuwe bijukize bironji, atinu mwana watu kusinti izo mtu wabuli jo. Hello friends, welcome back to Love Media where we spread love. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe and hit the notification bell. Today we gonna look at the most sexiest celebrities in Nigeria and we gonna look at Tiwa Savage. Taking the ninth position as Nigeria most sciest woman, is Nigeria number one female superstar, Tiwa Savage. This woman is also called the first lady of Supreme Maven Dynasty. Tiwa Savage is also the sciest artist in Nigeria, she's is not the sciest just because of her heights, but also has a sultry voice, beautiful eyes, and hot body. Even when she was pregnant, you simply cannot change that fact that she is very s epsilon xy. As a mother of one, Tiwa Savage is still slaying, and continue been among the list of Nigeria most seest female superstars. Tiwa Tope Savage, born February 5, 1980, is a Nigerian singer, songwriter, and actress. Born in Isale Eco, she relocated to London at the age of 11 for her secondary education. Five years later, she began her music career doing backup vocals for artists such as George Michael and Mary J. Blige. After participating in the UK edition of The X Factor and graduating from Berklee College of Music, Savage signed a publishing deal with Sony slash ATV Music Publishing in 2009 too inspired by the growth of the Nigerian music industry, Savage moved back to Nigeria and signed with Maven Records in 2012. She made an appearance on the label's 2012 compilation album Solar Plexus 3. Her debut studio album Once Upon a Time was released on 3 July 2013. It was supported by seven singles, Kale Kale Love, Love Me, 3X, Without My Heart, Ife W. Bona, Folarin, Olorun Me and Emanato. The album was nominated for Best Album of the Year at the 2014 Nigeria Entertainment Awards and for Best R&B Slash Pop Album at the Hedis 2014. Savage's second studio album R.E.D was released on December 19, 2015. It yielded two singles, My Darlin' and Standing Ovation. In June 2016, Savage signed a management and publishing deal with Rock Nation 4 in September 2017, she released her debut EP Sugarcane. R.E.D and Sugarcane have both been nominated for Best Album at the Nigeria Entertainment Awards. In November 2018, Savage won Best African Act at the 2018 MTV Europe Music Awards, becoming the first woman to win the category. In May 2019, she announced her record deal with Universal Music Group and exit from Maven Records 5 Savage Sings in English and Yoruba, her music is a blend of Afrobeats, R&B, Pop and Hip Hop 6 Savage's contributions to the Nigerian music industry have earned her several achievements. She has been involved in youth empowerment and breast cancer screening projects and has raised funds to build schools in Nigeria. Tiwa Tope Savage was born on February 5, 1980, in Isale Eco, Lagos State, Nigeria 7 her family relocated to London when she was 11 years old. While attending secondary school, she was a trombone player for her school's orchestra band. Savage graduated with a degree in accounting from the University of Kent, and started working at the Royal Bank of Scotland 7-6 she did backup vocals for English singer George Michael at the age of 16, and lent vocals to other musicians such as Mary J. Blige, Chaka Khan, Blue Cantrell, Emma Bunton, Kelly Clarkson, Andrea Bocelli, and Ms. Dynamite 8-9 Savage enrolled at Berklee College of Music and graduated with a degree in professional music in 2007-2006 while reminiscing about her experiences there, 
she said she was motivated by the drive and passion of the younger students. She also said she needed the school's atmosphere 7. In 2006, Savage participated in the UK edition of the X Factor and advanced to the final 24, but ended up being the 12th person to be evicted 10-9 while participating, she had difficulty dealing with the limelight. She said, you have to always realize that people are watching. When I got the bad news that I wasn't getting through to the final 12 it was a really painful time. But you still have to learn how to hold that until you get home. Because you don't want to just let everything out. People admire you and want to see that you're strong, they don't want to see you breaking down. 7. In 2009, Savage signed a publishing deal with Sony slash ATV Music Publishing. The deal allowed her to write for Babyface, Cat De Luna, Fantasia, Monica, and Maya. She has received songwriter credits for her contribution to Monica's soul-tinged ballad Catch Me.11 Her collaboration with Fantasia on the song Collard Greens and Cornbread earned the American Recording Artist a Grammy nomination in 2010. Savage wrote Jayako's Oh Yeah, featuring Snoop Dogg, and De Luna's Push Push, featuring Akon. She performed background vocals on Whitney Houston's album I Look To You, 2009, Dot 7 Inspired by the growth of the Nigerian music industry, Savage moved back to Nigeria and signed with Maven Records in 2012-12-8. 2010-2013, Once Upon a Time, Record Deal and Endorsements. Main Article, Once Upon a Time, Tiwa Savage Album. This album is straight from my heart and it's something that I've worked so tirelessly for. A lot of people wondered why it took me so long a time to drop my own album. That's because we had to go through a lot of legal processes to clear some of the samples that we used, and that took us some months. Also, we wanted to work with notable producers outside the shores of the country like Oak who produces Rihanna. So, we had to work around his schedule and waited for them to have our time. But this album is something that I really took my time with because I didn't want it to be the usual Nigerian album that contains just party tracks from the beginning till the end. Tiwa Savage, speaking to Vanguard about her debut studio album 13. In December 2011, Savage co-hosted the second season of Nigerian Idol alongside Il Rymz. She made her film debut with Joke Silva and Irdy Doyle in the stage adaptation of For Colored Girls. Savage established the 323 Entertainment record label with her former manager and husband Tunji T. Bills Balligan, to whom she got engaged on 5 February 2013-14. She joined Maven Records in 2012 and was one of the lead acts on the label's compilation album Solar Plexus, 2012.89 While attending Berklee College of Music, she networked with musicians Keith Harris, Derek Pate, Scott Coleman, Radar Ellis, and Darian Dorsey. In an interview with journalist Brenda Pike, she said she collaborated with producers Chuck Harmony, Warren Oakfelder, and Sasek, among others. She said her debut studio album would include songs in her native tongue Seven Savage was featured on the remix of Oi I in 2012. Prior to collaborating with Flavor, she recorded her own version of the song 15. In celebration of the 52nd anniversary of Nigeria's independence, Savage performed her rendition of Verize, O Compatriots for Ndani Session 16 in November 2012, she collaborated with Wage, Praise, T.I.M. Idikolo and Pamela Ego on the Ovation Red Carol theme song Higher.17 Savage started recording her debut studio album Once Upon a Time in 2010. She held an album listening party at the Wheat Baker Hotel in Ikoyi in May 2013. During the listening party, she revealed the entire track list of the album and announced Iceberg Slim, Sarko D, and General Pipe as featured acts 18. The album was released to the Nigerian public on July 3, 2013. It was released on iTunes a day before its official release. Savage named the album Once Upon a Time in order to portray the positive stories about her life. She said she wanted to motivate other upcoming artists by telling them that, once upon a time, she was a little girl in Isale Eco who dreamt of being a star. The album was supported by seven singles Kale Kale Love, Love Me, 
3x, without my heart, Ifa W Bona, Folarin, Olarun Me and Emanato. It also includes political songs like Middle Passage, which is about the struggles of African men in a foreign country 13 Once Upon a Time was nominated for Best Album of the Year at the 2014 Nigeria Entertainment Awards 19 It was also nominated for Best R&B Slash Pop Album at the Hedis 2014 20. Savage has been involved in many youth empowerment and breast cancer screening projects across Nigeria 913 She helped raise money for an organization that builds schools in her hometown. Savage signed an endorsement deal with MTN Nigeria in July 2013, reportedly worth 30 Nigerian Naira's million 21 She also signed endorsement deals with Pepsi 722 Forte Oil 23 and Maggi 24. 2014-2016 r.e.d and rock nation deal tiwa savage performing at bank's annual year end concert in december 2014 on january 31st 2014 savage released the spelts produced love in yellow in celebration of valentine's day the song has elements of retro r&b and funk 25 savage was featured on ricardo bank's 2014 single turn it up which was produced by Don Jazzy 26 on May 1, 2014, Maven Records released the Don Jazzy produced Doro Bucci, featuring vocals from Savage, Don Jazzy, Dr. Sid, D Prince, Ricardo Banks, Card Bello and DJ A2728. On May 19, 2014, Faustin Music premiered the Savage-assisted remix of Pator and King's Girlio. The song was produced by Wizzy Pro 29 The music video for the song was shot and directed in London by Mo Musa 30 on June 7, 2014, Savage performed at the 2014 MTV Africa Music Awards alongside Miguel, Flavor and Abanya, Divido, Mafikaizalo, Uhuru, Oskido, and Professor 31 The Mo Musa directed visuals for Wanted was released on 28 May 2014 32 It features Savage wearing a nude bodysuit and touching herself suggestively 33 The video's release prompted a huge public backlash across various social networking sites, including Facebook, Twitter and YouTube 34. In June 2014, Savage collaborated with Mikasa, Lola Ray, Sarko D, Diamond Platinums, and Divido on Africa Rising, a song for DSTV's campaign of the same name. The campaign was created to inspire Africans to partake in community-based social investment projects. The accompanying music video for Africa Rising was shot and directed by South African production house Callback Dreams 35. The artists performed the song at the Africa Rising launch ceremony in Mauritius 36. On December 19, 2015, Savage released her second studio album R.E.D., which is an acronym for Romance, Expression, and Dance 37. The album features guest appearances from Don Jazzy, Olamide, Dr. Sid, Iceberg Slim, Two Face Edabia, D Prince, Busy Signal, and Ricardo Banks 38. It was primarily produced by Don Jazzy, with additional production from Baby Fresh, Alt Hymns, Spelts, and P2J 38. The album was supported by two singles, My Darlin' and Standing Ovation. Its deluxe edition was released in February 2016 and features guest vocals from Wizkid and P Square 39 R.E.D was nominated for Best Album at the 2016 Nigeria Entertainment Awards 40 Savage recorded the album while pregnant with her son 38 The album was made available for free digital streaming on MTN Music on 21 December 2015 41 42 within 24 hours of its release. It became the music platform's most streamed album 41. The album was promoted through the website imred.com 43. In June 2016, there were reports in the media that Savage had signed a management and publishing deal with Rock Nation 44 on July 29, 2016. She made it official by announcing the deal through her Instagram account, making her the first Nigerian artist to be signed to the label 4445. 2017, present, Sugarcane, MTV Emma, and record deal with UMG. Savage performed on the Liberty stage of Jay-Z's Made in America Festival 46 during her performance, she brought out Young Paris for a performance of Best of Me, Remix, 
.46 Savage released her debut EP Sugarcane on September 22, 2017. It features collaborations with producers and guest artists such as Wizkid, Speltz, Baby Fresh, Malik Berry and P2J. It explores themes of love and was recorded in English and Yoruba. Sugarcane was nominated for Best Album of the Year at the 2018 Nigeria Entertainment Awards 47 Savage revealed to the Fader magazine that she did not have any plans to release the EP, but decided to put out the project after recording so much music for her upcoming album 48 Sugarcane is a mixture of Afropop, Funk, House, Pop Music, R&B, and Trap 49. On August 24, 2018, Savage headlined a concert at the O2's Indigo venue. General admission tickets sold out hours before the event. The concert featured additional performances from Don Jazzy, Ricardo Banks, DJ A, Dr. Sid, WSTRN, Aolo Longamba, Mistro and the alternate sound band 50 prior to the concert, Savage held a pop-up shop on Barrick Street 51 in November 2018, Savage won Best African Act at the 2018 MTV Europe Music Awards, becoming the first woman to win the category 52 Savage released the melodic track 1 on 15 November 2018 53 54 produced by Killer Tunes, it touches upon themes of gratitude 55 56. Akin Palaolu Waf on Mileo for Legit.ng described the song as an Afrobeat song with a soft tempo and smooth rhythm. Eichel Flow.57 On December 2, 2018, Savage performed at the 2018 Global Citizen Festival, Mandela 100, which took place at the FNB Stadium in Johannesburg, South Africa. 58 News about her performance at the festival was first reported in July 2018 59. The video for one was released on December 7, 2018. Directed by Clarence Peters, it was shot at a local beach in Azaroko, Lagos, Nigeria 6061 in January 2019. YouTube took down the video for one following accusations of copyright violations 55 due to not being able to verify a copyright violation. YouTube restored the video on 2 March 2019 55. On March 13, Savage was added to the lineup of artists who performed at the 2019 Wireless Festival 62 on May 2, 2019. Universal Music Group announced the signing of Savage to a seven year publishing and distribution deal 63. It was also revealed that she left Maven Records 64. F. Ogbeni of Regime Music Societe and Vanessa Amadiagbanna will be responsible for executive producing all of her projects under the label 6566. Savage's future music will be released through the label's operations in more than 60 countries. 64. In July 2019, Savage was featured on Keys to the Kingdom, a track she co-wrote for Beyoncé's soundtrack album The Lion King, The Gift. She appeared on the track alongside Mr. Isa 67. On September 5, 2019, Savage released 49-99, her first single with Motown Records. The song references the line 49 sitting, 99 standing from fella Anakula Pokuti's 1978 hit Shuffering and Schmiling. Described as a blend of Afrobeat, R&B, and pop music, 49 to 99 features syncopated percussion, humming background harmonies and crisp snares 68 The Mijilabi directed video for 49 to 99 features colorful imagery and symbolism. One of the video scenes references the iconic portraits of Congolese schoolgirls taken in 1972 by photographer Elliot Elisaphone 69 Another scene, in which Savage is laid out with lengthy braids, is reminiscent of Diana Ross' flower-accented look from the late 1960s 69. On November 19, 2019, Savage released the Black Jeers produced track Attention and the Fields produced track Owomida.70 in Attention, she admonishes her love interest for the lack of attention he is putting into their relationship while in Owomita, she makes cutthroat remarks at an unnamed borrower 70 Savage performed background vocals on Eco, a slow-burning ballad from Coldplay's eighth studio album Everyday Life, 2019.71 On August 18, 2020, Tiwa Savage released the track. List for the album Celia, 
and announced that the album will be released on 28 August 2072. Personal Life Savage was married to Tunji T. Bills Balligan. On November 23, 2013, the couple held their traditional marriage at the Ark in Lecky 7374. The couple's white wedding was held on April 26, 2014 at the Armani Hotel in Dubai 7576. On January 1, 2015, Savage and Balogun announced that they were expecting their first child together 77 six months later. Savage gave birth to their son 7879 on April 28, 2016. Balogun accused his wife of infidelity and his mother in law of witchcraft 80 in a 45 minute interview conducted by this day. Newspaper and Pulse Nigeria Savage extensively addressed her husband's lengthy social media posts regarding their marriage. She debunked her husband's infidelity claims and accused him of financial recklessness, drug addiction, and abandonment. 81 She said her marriage to him was over 81. On July 19, 2021, Tiwa lost her father after battling an undisclosed illness for a couple of years. 82 Tiwa revealed in an interview that someone is trying to extort her with a sex tape. 83. Controversy. On June 8, 2021, Tiwa Savage was reported to have been involved in a skirmish with Sai Aisha at an upscale saloon in Highbrow Lecky, Lagos 84. In a viral video, Tiwa was seen taking exception to Sai Aisha's greeting followed by an exchange of words and curses from both artists 85 according to Premium Times, Sai I had recorded a diss track in 2017, calling Tiwa several derogatory names 86 reports also say that earlier in 2015, Tiwa had shown her aversion to being asked about Sai Aisha's endorsement with Pepsi in a radio interview 87. Legacy Tiwa Savage has been cited as an inspiration and slash or influence by Ira Star and Brett Tina 8. Oyagalo mkuru kukwenja ulu kubirene vijukize mnyumba yo. Kan kwa njulire Baking Montage Photo Studio. Fiba kafurumu kube bifana nyi. No kola video. Oli na wedding. Birthday party. Kuchala. Nika. Baby shower. Photoshoot. Oba music shoot. Nabulichimu chonacho oyagala. Fetu subulu kuwe vijukize vironji. Iriye biroto vyo. Ateno mwana watu kusinti izo mtu wabuli jo. Tusangipa nankula vikubitala. Kuprime Tower. Level 3. Room D04. Okumanyi visingao. Tukubiru kunamba zino. Note msavu note bili. Emu note nya. Emu bili tanu. Oba, noti musavu tano tano, satu emu emu, musavu satu emu, oba, noti musavu musavu musavu, noti bili satu, nyan noti tano. King Montage Photo Studio, fetu sobolo kuwe bijukize bironji, ate no mwana watu kusinti zomu tuwabuli jo.